your boy Benny Stacks. I play Michael Porter in this great new film called Be Somebody. I'm Robin Rose and I play Jade in Be Somebody. Well, my experience working with, with this lady right here was amazing. It was amazing. It was more like, I learned a lot from her because like she's a wonderful actor and I'm new to it. So I learned a lot, picked up a lot. And plus I got the, you know, got the holder, stuff like that. So <laughs> I did, you know, I did my thing. B was a pleasure to work with. Um, we had a good time. We vibed right off that. Um, I got him to do duck lips. So we, um, we had a good time on set. It was really fun and great experience. How do I feel about a movie being shot at this magnitude in Detroit? I think it's good for the culture of Detroit. I think it's good for the movie scene here because a lot of movies is being shot here. And I think it's a revelation to be more productive in this movie, in this movie area in Detroit. This movie being shot here in Detroit is, I think what we need here in the city. Um, a lot of people don't really know like what Detroit has to offer. So us being able to do this project here just gives a lot of insight as to what Detroit really is and not what everyone sees on a day-to-day -day basis. Being in a movie with Cisco and Melvin, oh man, it was a pleasure to meet those guys. And they're a huge actors, huge stars. It just made me realize how far I can go in this movie career because they're all there. Besides everything they do, they're they're great. They're great people, and you you can learn a lot from them. Um, also, just seeing them how how they move and how they practice their their script and how they how they look in front of the camera. They're they're very professional. They're very professional guys. I love I love working with those guys. Uh, working with Cisco and Melvin uh, also is a pleasure. Uh, they're really down to earth and humble. A lot of times you would think that someone of that stature might be a little on edge, but it was a smooth, smooth and a breeze. Great. Working with the crew, oh man, this crew is amazing. Uh, very talented crew. This crew right here, is gonna do some major big things together. Um, shouts out to Dale, uh, that guy, that guy's great. You know, the uh, director, Don Overton, he's great. I mean, Don really, he's, he's gonna change, he's gonna change the movies, he's gonna change the culture. Uh, working with the crew is a blast. I don't consider them crew anymore. We've kind of become family in a sense. So anytime we get a chance to get together, it's all love. Well, I play a character, I play a, a unique guy called Michael Porter. His name is Michael Porter. Um, I think he's searching for power, but really doesn't have have what it takes to to own everything. So he's like, he's, he's a snakish guy and he's willing to do anything he has to do to get it. Jade is, I say about Jade. Jade, I think is in over her head. I think Jade in a sense is still trying to find herself. She thinks she knows everything and knows how to get what she wants, but I think she's a little lost and I think her decisions uh, may catch up with her in the end. Um, how did I prepare for my character? Uh, my story is kind of unique. I started on the opposite end of the camera. I was doing sound and my name was called, the opportunity came, and I jumped right in. As I got home, I, I studied the script. I built more of the character into what I would do and how I would play in certain situations. And it just worked. And along with the help of my uh, lovely co-host, she got me through it. Well, me and Jade are complete opposites, so I had to really like study the script to kind of get a sense of who she was and the story of Jade and Michael. Kind of, you know, bring that whole love, destructiveness to the screen. What's up next for me? I also do music. Um, I have an album coming out December 25th, Christmas. It's my Christmas gift to the world called Stack mm -hmm. Season. 
we also also getting involved with the clothing. Um, just basically open to more roles and just headed to the top. Um, what's next for me? Well, first of all, I'm very excited for me and oh, this yeah. Christmas album, but uh, the next project for me will be Struggle, which I'm really excited about. I can't give you too much information and detail, but it's gonna be phenomenal and I'm so excited and I can't wait. And hopefully me and V get to do something again. Oh yeah, definitely.